solve the following pairs of equations by reducing them to a pair of linear equations. Equation kya given a dekte? We are given 2 over root x plus 3 over root y is equal to 2 and 4 over root x minus 9 over root y is equals to minus 1. Now again, dono equation mein agar aap dekhe, to 1 by root x and 1 by root y wo common hai dono equation mein. Since 1 by root x and 1 by root y is common in both the equations, so let us assume that let us assume that 1 by root x is equal to p and 1 by root y is equals to q. Ab kya karenge? Hum is equation mein jahan jahan 1 by root x hai, dono equation, wahan hum p put karenge aur jahan 1 by root y hai, wahan hum q put karenge. Toh, jo equation x or y ke terms mein, wo p or q ke terms mein aajayega. Is equation ki baat karen, toh, yeh ho jayega 2p, kyunki 2 times of 1 by root x hai yeh. 2 by root x ka matlab hai 2 times of 1 by root x. So 1 by root x ko to aapne p assume kiya, to kya ban jayega? 2p. Thik? Now, similarly, ye ho jayega 3 upon root y jo hai, wo ban jayega 3q. Kyunki 1 by root y ki value kitni hai? Q. Is equal to 2. Call it as equation 1. Isko hum use karenge solve karne ke liye. Likewise, iski baat kare, to ye ban jayega 4p minus 9q is equal to minus 1 and Call it as equation 2. Ab in dono equation ko aapko solve karna. Jisse aapko p or q pata chal jayega. Or usse baad mein hum finally x or y find out kar sakte hain. Again, question mein mention nahi ki is method se solve karna. To aapki free choice hai. Aap kisi bhi algebraic method se isko solve kar sakte hain. Mein phir se elimination method prefer karunga. Second equation ko iske niche lik dete hain. 4p minus 9q is equal to minus 1. Ab agar mein q ko eliminate karna chahu dono equation se to first equation ko agar aap 3 se multiply kar denge to ye 9q ban jayega to usse q ka coefficient dono equation mein same ho jayega to wo eliminate ho jayega usse aap p calculate kar sakte hain to jo first equation hai ab wo 3 se multiply ho ke kya ban jayega aapka main idhar likhta hu usko 6p plus 9q is equal to 6 और इस इक्वेशन को सेकंड इक्वेशन को ऐसा सच रखते हैं इसको आप चाहे तो थर्ड बोल सकते हैं और सेकंड इक्वेशन को ऐसा सच इसके नीचे कॉपी कर देता हूं मैं 4p 9q is equal to minus 1 ये आपका सेकंड इक्वेशन था तो अब 9 का कोएफिशिएंट सेम हो गया और साइन ऑपोजिट है तो इसलिए आप सिंपली ऐड कर दीजिए दोनों इक्वेशन को तो उससे q जो है वो कैंसिल हो जाएगा q वेरिएबल जो आपका कैंसिल हो जाएगा ये टर्म तो कैंसिल हो गया 6p plus 4p will give you 10p is equal to 6 plus minus 1 तो ये हो जाएगा 5 जिससे आपको p की वैल्यू मिलेगी 1 by 2 क्योंकि 5 upon 10 होता है 1 by 2 और जैसे ही आपको p की वैल्यू मिली आप किसी भी क्वेश्चन में पुट करके q find out कर सकते हैं से अगर मैं यहाँ पुट करना चाहूँ तो ये हो जाएगा 4 into p के प्लेस पे पुट करूँगा 1 by 2 minus 9q is equal to minus 1 तो अब ये क्या होगा देखिए 2 से 2 कैंसिल हो गया तो 2 minus 9q is equal to minus 1 और साइड अगर आप चेंज करेंगे minus 1 को आप इधर ले आइए minus 9q को RHS में तो 2 plus 1 is equal to 9q हो जाएगा जिससे आपको 3 is equal to 9q मिलेगा which gives us q as 1 by 3 ठीक q इससे आपको मिलेगा 1 by 3 अगेन आपको p और q कैलकुलेट नहीं करना था हमको x और y कैलकुलेट करना तो यहाँ पे लि� p as 1 by root x और p की value कितनी है आपके पास 1 by 2 but we have p as 1 by 2 therefore 1 by 2 is equal to 1 by root x तो cross multiply करेंगे तो ये हो जाएगा root x is equal to 2 on squaring both the sides we will get x as 4 likewise अगर y के लिए काम करें तो again यहाँ पे मैं लिखता हूँ consider q is equal to 1 by root y but we have q as 1 by 3 therefore 1 by 3 is equal to 1 by root y again on cross multiplying we will get root y is equal to 3 and on squaring both the sides we will get y as 9 so the solutions of the given pair of linear equations uh, are x is equal to 4 and y is equal to 9 so this completes our solution. Let us now move on to 
next section of the same question.